I want to speak on what I titled Deep Pit. Deep Pit. Where you are in a deep pit, you will have plenty trouble, plenty of troubles. Now listen, I'm not talk much money this morning. When your agenda was announced in heaven, was everyone here hearing the sound of my voice? You have your divine agenda, and it was announced in heaven. When it was announced, the kingdom of darkness had it clearly and well. And they won't fold their hands to allow you to become what heaven had destined you to become. They will go all out to stop you. Because if they allow you, you will stop them. Because heaven has announced your words, your divine agenda. What you are going to be in life. Like Joseph, his divine agenda was announced. And members of his own family, members of what his own family came together to do what? To destroy his destiny. But somehow God intervened. He was thrown into a pit. And there's yeah, something I want you to understand. If it is possible for him to come out, he would have come out when they left there. But there was nobody kept there to be watching over him. He was 17 years old. How many years? 17 years. So they put him in a deep pit. When one is in a deep pit, your divine agenda is suspended. When one is in a deep pit, his destiny has been buried. If one is in a deep pit, you can never be announced. If you are in a deep pit, whatever you are doing will not see the light of God. If you are in a deep pit, you can't fulfill your divine agenda. Praise the Lord. And the enemies can use anything. To stop you from fulfilling your divine agenda. Let's see the scripture again that we read. The mouth of the strange woman is a deep pit. So as a man, one of the things that will put you in a deep pit is what? 
a strange woman. As a young lady, one of the things that will put you in a deep pit is what? A man. Is a man. Therefore, this morning, I advise you run away from anything that will lead you into the deep pit. Because when you are there inside the deep pit, your destiny is buried. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. If you are in a deep pit, your marriage will be hanged. If you are in a deep pit, you will have hell challenges. If you are in a deep pit, it will ruin your future. And as I said before, if you are in a deep pit, you have plenty of troubles. Whenever you disobey the voice of God, you enter into a deep pit. Some of you hearing the sound of my voice, even from the zoo, where you are now, presently, is where you're supposed to be 20 years ago. And it's not a good story. Therefore, this money, you will do your best to come out of the deep pit. Whether you are the one that put yourself inside the deep pit, whether you inherited it from your father, from your mother, if God sees your heart, he will bring you out from the deep pit. Praise the Lord. Where you're supposed to be 20 years ago, and today you are there. Is it a good story? It is not. It is not. Everything that has to do with God has to do with what? Moving forward. Moving forward. When heaven announced your divine agenda, the kingdom of darkness will work out a system to do what? To trap you. To stop you from fulfilling your divine agenda. And if you are not careful, the trap will catch you. Praise the Lord. Therefore, you hearing the sound of my voice. If you want to fulfill your divine agenda, make sure you remain holy. You remain what? Holy. Run away from unholiness. Run away from unrighteousness. Because if you 
fail to live a holy life, you enjoy committing sin. When you continue to commit sin, sin will sink your destiny. Sin will do what? Sink your destiny. Run away from it. Look at what the Bible says. The mouth of a strange woman is what? A deep pit. Let me paraphrase that in the, the verse. They that disobey God will fall inside it. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. There is no way you can follow God in truth and in spirit and the enemy will trap you. It's not truth. They can't get you. They can't get you. A lot of the children of God are in trouble today because of disobedience. You may hide to commit sin. The Bible said something. This evening, and I call it yesterday, I think I use it. I think numbers, let me check what is numbers 32 23. Put it, let me see what I is what I want. Okay? But if you will not do so, that is when you fail to obey God, behold, you have sinned against the Lord. And because you have sinned against the Lord in the secret where you think nobody knew, where you think nobody saw you, look at what will happen. Be sure your sin will find you out. He didn't say men. Be sure. The sin of the world will find you out. So, my dear, if you want to fulfill your divine agenda, what do you do? Run away from anything that will put you in the deep. If you are in a deep pit, it will take the grace of God for you to be delivered. Joseph was put in a physical pit. He couldn't come out. How much more spiritual deep pit? Look at what the Bible says in I think first Corinthians six from eighteen. Flee, let's read together to go. Flee fornication. Everything that a man doeth is without the body. But he that committed fornication sin against his own body and it will lead you into what deep pit you may think you are free my dear you are not free you are not free you are not free everything on earth has time when you are involved in this, you are deposing part of your body. 
in different places and taking some parts into your life. When you fornicate or have adultery with a marine woman, a man that belongs to the marine kingdom, it will deposit some part of marine inside you and your life will never be, be the same again. With an occult man, the man will deposit part of him inside you and you also will be inside with a winch or a wizard will deposit part of you inside and you will also deposit part of you will also deposit part of inside him or her and you are praying winch die die and you are the winch Praise the Lord. That's why it is called what? Deep pit. Deep pit. You need God's grace to be able to understand it. So, if you want to fulfill divine agenda, flee fornication. Flee adultery. Live a willing life. Because if you fail to live a holy life, the Bible says, yes, be sure that your sin will do what? Will find you out. Let's see verse 19 and 20. What? Know you not your body? Know you not that your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost hmm. which is in you which you have of God and you are not your own somebody paid a price for you he bought you with a price verse 20 for you are bought with a price you are bought with what? A prize. Therefore, glorify God in your body and in your spirit, which are God's. So, if you want to avoid the pit, avoid the sin. Because if you fail to avoid it, you will be in the pit. Whether you are married or not, and at a appointed time, the heat will be all over you. Everything on earth has what you call what? Appointed time. Appointed time. So, when one is in a deep pit, you are under a heavy course. That's why you see people, they are complaining. They are complaining. Some are even blaming God. You won't tell yourself the truth of what you have done. What you have done is what is dealing with you. So, don't blame God. Praise the Lord. You matter how colorful your divine destiny may look like or may be if you are in a deep pit, it can never manifest. Is it colorful? Yes! You are destined to rule and reign. To be in charge. But you are in a deep pit. 
and there's no way your destiny can speak from the deep pit. That's why it is important for you to maintain holiness and righteousness. To avoid entering into a deep pit. Praise the Lord. A lot of people hearing the sound of my voice. The day it was born, it was announced that you will rewrite the destinies of your family. You are the one that will rewrite the destinies of the family. But when you find yourself in a deep pit, that task becomes what? Impossible. And your family will remain in bondage. And I ask God, where are you? God has sent somebody who will rewrite the destinies of the family. But that person, carelessly, Careless, destroyed his destiny, destroyed her destiny by himself or herself. I have said it here one or twice that one girl just about this height, everybody like this, dark in color. came for deliverance. And when she met me after teaching, he said, Pastor, that she has killed 35 men. Praise the Lord. She don't have AK-45. Neither do she have any revolver. She killed them. With her private parts. Sometimes... Let me swallow what I want to say. Because what you call private part is a public part. She says, I keep that five men. And the young men, she took away their destiny. She can't count them. The girl, she is dark in complexion. But the truth remains that she's beautiful. If you look at her skin, you will see her face there. One of the people have, might have had me, she has a baby in her back. And the baby, her head is smoother than the satire. When I asked her, why you no? Know, first, when she came and told me this, I said, come, go, 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 go. You are wicked. Go. I drove her away from my office. Later, she came back. When she came back, I allowed her to sit down. We begin to talk. Because I know I'm going to gain experience there also to add to what I know. Because whenever I'm talking, I don't like talking here, I say. It must be one on one discussion. The person involved, when I ask you questions, you will answer me, convince me. 
Now what you are telling me is the truth. Sir, the young man she slept with, she took away their destinies and gave it to their mama in the water. And the mama in the water distributes the destinies to their members to make money. Praise the Lord. I said, this 35 you kill, why can't you take their destiny and leave them alive, the other ones? He said, these ones, their destiny is attached to their lives and it's too bright. There's no way you can separate it from them. Before you will get it, you have to kill them before you can take it. Deep it. Deep it. Then I asked her, this one that are dead, they are gone. The one that are living how can their destinies be restored back to them? He said, sir, it is hard. It is what? Hard. But what she's seeing here, based on what she's saying and the way the prayer is touching her. But she thinks that this type of prayer is what can restore their destiny back. Praise the Lord. She's answering me from her mind, not what she was told. Then I asked her, the baby at your back, why is no hair? He said they are using her hair to wash plates in the marine kingdom. That instead of the hair growing on her head, that one will be growing, they will be dividing it to wash plates at the Hazi kingdom. That as I'm seeing her now, money is not her problem. He said she can ride any type of car she wants anytime. But she's tired of the whole thing. She wants to come out. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. This was a deep pit that has swallowed so many world destinies. So many destinies. Young girl that's supposed to marry who is who in the society have surrendered their destiny to evil men. Young men that are supposed to occupy important positions have surrendered their destiny to evil women and they are right inside the deep pit under heavy course. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. So be careful. Be what? Careful. That track is not a track you come. You, you follow, sorry. And you can't follow that track and remain whom you are. Once you enter there, you deposit part of you inside the deep pit. Spiritually, you will be going about. Physically, you are going about. Spiritually, in the deep pit. Struggling with life. Fighting with everything. Thinking that somebody is holding you. Not knowing. 
that what you committed is what is holy you. But I believe that this morning, by God's grace, many destinies will be set free. Proverbs chapter 7, 26 and 27. Let's read together. One, two, go. For she hath cast down many wounded, and yea, many strong men have been slain by her. Cast down many women. Many strong men have been what slain. Including one time head of state of this country. I didn't mention any name. If you call him name, you call. Praise the Lord. Make us that many wounded. Can a wounded soldier be agile in the war front? And something now. Cast down many world wounded. I think Proverbs 2. Remember the person that wrote Proverbs has how many women? How many? What thousand? So he's talking boats that is on a boat, the wisdom given to him by God and the experience. Proverbs chapter 2, verse 18 and 19. There about. For, let's read together. For her house incline unto what? Death. And her path unto what? 19. Or stop at 18. Mm. Let's read together to go. No, that go unto her, return again. Neither take the hood of the path of life. That's why you see a lot of marriages ruined. A lot of people in trouble. They go to church, yet they are struggling because they are in a deep pit. They are where? In a deep pit. It wanted the grace of God to deliver such a man, such a woman. And if time is not taken, he or she will pass the battle into the children. The worst. The worst. So, my dear, when one is in a deep pit, you will be confused. Are you praying? Yes, you are praying. Are you fasting? You are fasting. Yet, you are not making any headway. When it's time, you will be jumping up. My dear, repent! Or you will perish. It is time to say nothing but the truth. The truth. The truth. You can't be in a deep pit. And remember whom you are. You can't be in a deep pit and you want to fulfill your divine agenda. 
It's not truth. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Church. If you really want to make it, you must avoid anything that will put you in what in a debate. You cannot be a blessing to your generation until you come out of the pit. Remember, God told Abraham, I will bless you and you will be a blessing to your world generation. So this morning is left for you to fight seriously to come out from the deep pit. You have suffered and all. The worst is a man or a woman that God, I've said it here, has equipped. He prepare you in heaven to rewrite the destiny, destinies of your family. And you carelessly enter into a deep pit, leaving the family in a dungeon, leaving the family in a deep pit. My dear, a heaven will not forgive you. You will be judged and condemned. Because you have destroyed a lot of destinies. God saw what, is, what was happening in that family. And he prepared it in heaven. And announced that you are going to be the light in the family. And you carelessly fall into a deep pit. And the family remain in bondage. Heaven will never be happy with you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Or oh, don't you know that every family has a Messiah? Every family has what? A Messiah. Sometimes the family will kill the Messiah because of jealousy. If they kill the Messiah, they will remain in perpetual world bondage. They will remain in the pit. If the Messiah carelessly destroyed his own destiny, the family will also remain in bondage. Look at what Jesse went through. Because his destiny was so colorful. When he escaped destruction from his own people, his own world, People. Let's say Jeremiah 12 6. Let's say identity and good news. Let me see how they put it. For even their brethren and the house of their father, even they have dealt anxiously with thee. Yea, they have called a multitude after thee. Believe them not, though they speak fair words unto you. Let's see NLT and good news. A clearer translation. Even your brothers, 
members of your own family have turned against you. The plots and raise complaints against you. Do not trust them, no matter how pleasantly they speak. Good news. Praise the Lord. Even your relatives, members of your own family, have betrayed you. They join in the attacks against you. Do not trust them, even though they speak friendly words. Praise the Lord. When Joseph escapes through divine intervention to a strange land from his brothers, Satan didn't fold his hands. Why? He knew that the destinies of the damn world was upon the shoulder who Joseph. If not for single person Joseph, a lot of people would have what perish. Satan knew it. And he prepared Pontifar's wife to make sure that the destiny of Joseph was what? Destroyed. But God was with him. He answered the woman. Everything in this house is under me. It's only you that my master kept from me because you are his wife. How can I do this? Great sin against my God and against my master. I will not do it. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And he ran away. When he ran away, When Pontifar came back, the wife presented a false evidence that look real. That look what? Real. You know what I mean by that? You don't know. She brought the dress of who? David. And showed the husband that. The young man, when he was running away, when he was shouting, he left his words. A false evidence that look real. That's why a lot of people make mistakes. That's why you hear the sound of my voice. It is not every evidence you have to take. Scrutinize, be careful. That evidence was false, but it looks what? Real. It looks real. Looks real. And the man was an officer. Nothing stopped him from pulling his service pistol and killed Joseph. He bought him with his money. But he put him in prison. You see what happened? Later, the damn world was saved by one man. If he has toyed with destiny and then agree with the woman to have everything she needed in that house, but his divine destiny would have what be ruined. Therefore, my dear. Discover your divine agenda and make sure you don't destroy it by yourself. If you do, you have yourself to be blessed. Praise the Lord. So this morning, you 
we cry unto God in prayer. You know yourself. You know what you have done. You know what you have done. And God is the one that will set you free. Stand. Let's stand up. Let's stand up. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We may pack the chair later. If you are not cooperating. A young man came. A young man. And says he need deliverance. He need words. And came with three calories. What is it called? Is it not calorie? Eh? That's the name of it. A guy. Was, he was asked, You need deliverance. What are you doing with this calorie? He laughed. He said, Pastor, one country here contains 100 destinies of men and women. One. Which means the three contain how many destinies? 300 destinies of young men and women. I was asked, How? He explains. And we asked, What do you want us to do? He said, As he's been delivered, he wants these 300 men and women to be set free. He has held them captive for years. They are struggling. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. They are what you call the mysteries of iniquity. One day, I will have time to preach on what you call the mystery of what iniquity. So there are a lot of things on earth you can't explain. I think I I don't know whether First Corinthians two seventeen or Second Corinthians two seventeen. Let's see First Corinthians two seventeen. No, give me King James. I don't want seventeen. No. Thessalonians. Sorry, I didn't you say Corinthians. Thessalonians 2.17. First Thessalonians 2.17. I got 2.17 or 2 second Corinthians. Thessalonians. Okay, let's see first. If I can't get it any other time. For we bring them being taken from you for a short time in the presence, not in time. Let's see 117. In both. What you call mystery. Mystery of iniquity. Praise the Lord. 
a lot of things is going on on earth that you need to be careful very careful because if you are not careful then you will be in trouble Things to come from the bodies. Huh? Verse. Two verse. No. I saw it. I will get to it later, maybe as we progress. Stand on your feet. So they in the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, my Father, deliver me from the deep pit. Any power of force holding me inside the deep pit, let that power be destroyed. This day, I must be free. Lord Jesus, as I release the blood of Jesus Christ, as I release the blood of Jesus Christ, one hundred times, one hundred times, let the blood of Jesus Christ, let the blood of Jesus Christ deliver me, deliver me, and set me free, and set me free. So much you count the blood of Jesus Christ hundred times one to go. The blood of Jesus one, the blood of Jesus two, the blood of Jesus three, the blood of Jesus four, the blood of Jesus five, the blood of Jesus six, the blood of Jesus seven, the blood of Jesus eight, the blood of Jesus nine, the blood of Jesus ten, the blood of eleven, the blood of Jesus twelve, the blood of Jesus, thirteen. The blood of Jesus, fourteen. The blood of Jesus, fifteen. The blood of Jesus, sixteen. The blood of Jesus, seventeen. The blood of Jesus, eighteen. The blood of Jesus, nineteen. The blood of Jesus, twenty. The blood of Jesus, twenty-one. The blood, twenty-two. The blood, twenty-three. The blood, twenty-four. The blood, twenty-five. The blood, twenty-six. The blood, twenty-seven. The blood, twenty-eight. The blood 29 the blood 30 the blood 31 the blood 32 the blood 33 the blood 34 the blood 35 the blood 36 the blood 37 the blood 38 the blood 39 the blood 40 the blood 41 the blood 42 the blood 43 the blood 44 the blood 45 the blood 46 the blood 47 the blood 48 the blood 49 the blood 50 the blood 51 the blood 52 the blood 53 the blood 54 the blood 55 the blood 56 the blood 57 the blood 58 the blood 59 the blood 60 the blood 61 the blood 62 the blood 63 the blood 64 the blood 65 the blood 66 the blood 67 the blood 68 the blood 69 the blood 70 the blood 71 the blood 72 the blood 73 the blood 74 the blood 75 the blood 76 the blood 77 the blood 
Look at what I'm trying to say. In Second Thessalonians 2 7, not 17, 2 7. The miss, I don't I won't have time to talk on it. For the mystery of iniquity do it already what work. Mystery of iniquity do it already work. Only he who now lets, lets, will let, until he be taken out of the way. <laughs> For you to fulfill your divine agenda, it must be taken out of the way. Out of what? The way. Out of the mystery of iniquity. I will talk on it one day. Do you understand what it means? Until it is well taken out of when is there you, you are going nowhere. Until it's taken out of the way. So me in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. My father, my father. My father, my father. By your mercy. By your mercy. Let the blood of Jesus Christ. Let the blood of Jesus Christ deliver me. Deliver me from every deep pit. From every deep pit. From every deep pit. From every deep pit. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. This morning. This morning. Deliver me. Deliver me from the deep pit. From the deep pit. Open your mouth and demand for it. My father, my father, this morning, deliver me from the deep pit. Deliver me from the deep pits. Deliver me from the deep pits. Deliver me from the deep pits. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, deliver me, oh God. Deliver us from the deep pits. In the mighty name of Jesus. Deliver us, oh God. Deliver our family members from the deep pits in the mighty name of jesus deliver me oh god from the deep pits in the mighty name of jesus by your mercy deliver us oh god this morning from the deep pits in the mighty name of jesus in jesus name amen so me in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. My father, my father. My father, my father. By your grace. By your grace. I am coming out. I am coming out. From every deep pit. From every deep pit. Holding my destiny. Holding my destiny. Holding me. Holding me. Holding my marriage. Holding my marriage. My father, my father. My father, my father. I am coming out. I am coming out. I will never remain there. I will never remain there. This morning. This morning. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I am coming out of the deep pit. I am coming out from the deep pit. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. In your name. In your name. I command. I command. I demand. I demand. Angels of God. 
deliver me. Angels of God, 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 deliver me. Yes, sir. Angels of God, deliver me. Yes, of deliver me. Yes, of God, deliver me. Yes, of God, deliver me. 
Thessalonians 2 7. 2 7. He said, Look, as he said, for the mystery of iniquity, do it already walk. He's walking already. Only he who now let it will let, will let, until he be taken out of the way. Until he be what 
taken out of the way. You can't take Satan out of the way by pleading. No? The violence must take it by what? Force! To apply force. You need to apply force. So, apply more force. Because where you are now is not your final bus stop. What you are going through now is not of God. I have told you, and it remains the truth. Your own destiny has been announced in heaven. It's the mystery of the iniquity is what holding you. Don't worry, if you are lucky with here, the day I will talk about the mystery of what iniquity. You understand why people are going through what they're going through. Is a deep teaching, deep, very deep mystery of all iniquity. Certainly, so in the name of Jesus Christ. In, in the, the name, name of, of Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ. My Father, my Father. My, my Father, father my, my Father. Every deep pit. Every deep pit. Holding my destiny. Holding, holding my destiny. destiny. Holding my promotion, holding my promotion, holding my health, holding my health, holding my business, holding my business, holding my finances, holding my finances, holding my fruitfulness, holding my fruitfulness. You are a liar. You are a liar. This morning, this morning. I am breaking out. I am breaking, I am breaking out. out. As I'm breaking out. As I'm breaking out. I am breaking out with my marriage. I am breaking out with my marriage. I am breaking out with my finances. I am breaking out with my finances. I am breaking out with my promotion. I am breaking out with my promotion. Understand? Understand what you are saying. When you say you are breaking out. It means you are coming out with what your marriage, your finances, or whatever that the deep it is holding, so that you understand me better. Serve me in the name of Jesus Christ. In, in the, the name, name of, of Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. My Father, my Father. My, my Father, father my, my Father. This morning. This morning. This morning I must be free. I must be free from the deep pit. From the deep pit. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. As I break out. As I break, as I break out, out. As I break out. As I break, I break out. From the deep pit. From the deep pit. I am coming out. I am, I am coming, coming out. out with my divine help. With, with my, my divine, divine help. help. I am coming out. I am, I am coming, coming out, out with my finances. With my, finances. my finances. I am coming out. I am, I am coming, coming out, out with my glory. With, with my, my glory. glory. I am coming out. I am, I am coming, coming out. out with whatsoever the enemy has taken from me. With whatsoever, with whatsoever the enemy has taken from me. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. As I break out. As I break, I break out. out what heaven announced what heaven announced concerning me concerning me more be fulfilled more be fulfilled every power of force every power of force inside the deep pit inside the deep pit holding my glory holding my glory holding what belong to me holding what belongs to me in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ I break out I break out I break out. 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 I break out, 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 
Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, Jesus Christ. My father, my father. My father, my father. I will not remain where I am. I will not remain where I am. I must move forward. I must move forward. Spiritually. Spiritually. Physically. Physically. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Any power of force. Any power of force. Occupy him. Occupy my seat of glory. My, my seat, seat of, of glory. glory. This morning. This morning. You must be overthrown. You, you must, must be overthrown. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Jesus. Any power of force. Any, any power, power of force. Occupy. Occupy. My seat of announcement. My, my seat, seat of announcement. My financial seat. My, my financial, financial seat. seat. This morning. This morning. I overthrow all of you. I overthrow, I overthrow all, of you. all of you. Lord Jesus. Lord, Lord Jesus. Jesus. I know. I know. You created me. You created, you created me. me. To rule and reign. To rule, to rule and, reign. and reign. I have dominion. I have, I have dominion. dominion. You matter whatsoever. No matter, no matter whatsoever. whatsoever. The enemy has done. The enemy, the enemy has, done. has done. This morning. This morning. I will recover. I will, I will recover. recover. All they have taken from all me. All they have taken from, from me. Lord Jesus. Lord, Lord Jesus. Jesus. In your name. In, in your, your name. name. I declare this morning. I declare, I declare this, morning. this morning. No man can stop me. No man can, no stop, man me. Man can stop me. No woman can stop no me. Woman no can woman stop can me. stop me. No power of force. No, no power, power of force. force. Created by God. Created by created God. By God. Can stop me. Can stop, stop me. me. Because. Because. I am an express image of the living God. I am an express image of the living God. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. In your name. In your name. I command. I command. Every power of force. Every power of force. Hold it. Hold it. What will announce me? What will announce me? Sitting on my seat. Sitting on my seat. 
My seat of glory. My seat, my seat of, of glory. glory. Seat of announcement. My seat, my seat of, of announcement. Financial seat. My financial my seat. seat. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name, In the name of, Jesus. of Jesus Christ. I command. I, I command. command. We command. We, we command. command. The blood of Jesus Christ overthrow them. The Lord 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 of Jesus Christ overthrow them. The blood of Jesus, 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 Jesus, 
blood of Jesus, the 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 blood of
Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. My Father, my Father. My Father, my Father. My father. I will never die destiny unfulfilled. I will, I will never, never die, die destiny unfulfilled. Therefore, therefore, anything, anything, whether powers, whether powers, whether forces, whether forces, targeting my life, targeting my life for destruction, for, for destruction. destruction this year and beyond. This, this year, year and beyond. beyond. You are a liar. You, you are, are a liar. liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. You will destroy yourself. You will destroy yourself. My father, my father. My father, my father. father, my father. My father. In the remaining months of this year and beyond. In the remaining months of this year and beyond. No ambulance. No ambulance. Will enter, will enter into my family. Into my family. I will, I will not lose any member of my family. I will not lose any member of my family. I will not lose any of my children. I will not lose any of my children. My children and my family. My children and my family will not lose me. Will not lose me. Therefore, therefore, any power, any power, any force, any force. Targeting any of force. Targeting any of us for destruction. For destruction. My father, my, my father, father and my father. It is written. It is written. The angels excel in strength. The angels excel in strength. Therefore, therefore, any power of force. Any power of force that want me to cry. That want me to cry. Or want my family to cry. Or want my family to cry. No matter where you are coming no from, no matter where you are coming from, today marks your end. Today marks your end. Today marks your end. Today marks your end. end. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, every power of force, every power of force that want to kill me in the dream world, to kill me in the dream world, or any of my family member, or any of my family member, or any of my children, or any of my children, you are a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. You are a liar. 
in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I command. I command. We command. We command. Angels of God, destroy them now. 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 Angels of God. Go to war. 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 Go to war.
just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to war. Just to slide them. Go to your mouth. 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 Go to your
My father, my father, my father, my father, whatsoever, whatsoever, my children touch, my children touch, my children handle, my children handle, we never die in their hands, we never die in their hands. My father, my father, my father, my father, I declare this morning, I declare this morning, for it is written, for it is written. Those that seek you early in the morning, those that seek you early in the morning, we find you. We find you. You are with us. You are with us. You are with me. You are with me. Therefore, therefore, I declare. I declare. I will never. I will never be disgraced in life. Be disgraced in life. I will never. I will never be put to shame. Be put to shame. My father, my father. My father, my father. I belong to this altar. I belong to this altar. Therefore, therefore, any altar, any altar, raise any will, raise any will, consulted, consulted by any man, by any man, by any woman, by any woman, to walk, to walk against my health, against my life, 
against my health against my health against my marriage against my marriage against the works of my hands against the works of my hands against my children against my children Utter, o, o, utter. Utter, o, utter. Rise in in anger. Rise in anger. And swallow them. And swallow them. And swallow them. And swallow them. My father, my father. My father, my father. The seed in my hand. The seed in my hand is called the seed of life. It's called the seed of life. Put the seed in your hand. The seed of life, not in house seed. The seed of life. Put it in your hands. Serve me in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. With this seed in my hand. With this seed in my hand. I declare. I declare. No man. No man. No woman. No woman. Can take away my life. Can take away my life. No matter their sacrifices. No matter their sacrifices. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, I belong to this altar. I belong to this altar. Altar of divine majesty. Altar of divine majesty. Protect me. Protect me. Protect my wife. Protect my wife. Protect my children. Protect my children. Protect my business. Protect my business. Protect my finances. Protect my finance. Protect my health. Protect my health. Any power of force. Any power of force that want me to go down. That want me to go down. Utter o utter. Utter o utter. Fight against that man. Fight against that man. In the morning hours. In the morning hours. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. Fight against him. Fight against him. Oh, in, at night. At night. At night. At night. Fight against him. Fight against him. Fight against them. Fight against them. And bring them down. And bring them down. Disgrace all of them. Disgrace all of them. Put them to shame. Put them to shame. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. Of the Son. And of the Son. And the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name. Amen.